Well, they say when times are tough, people go to the movies. And that was certainly the case in 2009. This year has been a box office bonanza. Ticket sales topped $10 billion for the first time, and no weekend as big as Christmas weekend. Here's ABC's Clayton Sendow. They may not be going to the same movie. We're just about to see The Blind Side. You have to protect them from those guys. But they are going. We're going to see Invictus. We need inspiration, Francois. We bought tickets to see It's Complicated. Why give it away when you can? <gasps> oh, God. It's boom time at the multiplex right now as people are finding that going to the movies is a relative perceived bargain. But beyond that, they're really enjoying this crop of movies this year, and that's really paying off dividends for Hollywood. Dividends that for the first time are on track to top $10 billion this year. Come on, that's what I'm talking about. And thanks in part to these guys, the 3D epic Avatar, Naughty. and Sherlock Holmes, <laughs> this Christmas day was the biggest ever at the box office. Most engaging. Ticket sales this weekend could push a quarter of a billion dollars. That's more than the annual economic output of some small countries and planets. Despite a recession and the wallet-busting prices of popcorn, candy, and soda, why are movies raking in the dough? You really want to know? If you had really bad movies out there, it wouldn't matter if the ticket price was $2. But when it's $10, it's actually more important that the movies deliver. You should see your faces because that's hard-earned cash today. Hard-earned cash that's keeping the business part of show business well in the black. For Good Morning America, Clayton Sandell, ABC News, Hollywood.